hello guys welcome in this new video and we've got like a little bit of updates about our lives what's happening in the past two weeks why we did not upload any videos because we were quite busy with moving yeah we were moving out from my village to the city nearby because of uh, our work and in this video we are going to explore this city the city is Ostrava like we are going to some places nearby and some interesting places and then we are going to take you for a room tour of our flat where we live so keep watching guys and enjoy this video so guys we've just arrived to the Ostravitkovice here behind me you can see the abandoned steel factory like in the past it was production of steel like for now there are still some little parts which are still working we are going to walk around see what's interesting in here and after that we are going to transfer to the center of the city visit some squares streets interesting so let's see what we are going to find out here hello guys so right now we are in the museum of the steel factory in Vitkovice, Ostrava city. So um, this steel factory was working way back then but I guess Kuba said like there are only some parts of this factory are still working and people can come here and have um, a walk and just just some tour. So yeah it's my first time Like right now we are crawling in the streets of Ostrava eating an ice cream and we are quite impressed like Ostrava is Ostrava is really nice city even so many people were telling me like oh my god you are moving to Ostrava it's a horrible city but actually the opposite is correct 
There is everything you need for life. So many job opportunities, so many places to live, room for rent, room for sale, houses for sale, groceries, everything is here. The only way people still think it's horrible city is because of that coal mining and steel industry do to destroy the city so much but <coughs> current leaders of the city were working hard and make it look very nice still so many green spots in the city parks everything is working fine and i guess i can say for both of us it's really nice city it's a very beautiful city yeah very beautiful city so let's see how long we are going to stay here and for now we are already done with exploring and we are going back to our home and we will show you how it everything looks there and the area around guys we just arrived <coughs> here is the complex of these buildings with condos and flats this one is ours and what i really like that i can see from the window on the parking and see the car if it's okay and if it's not stolen because that's one of the biggest problems here in ostrava ostrava is prone to theft so many times during the day i'm checking if the car is there So welcome here in our flat, it's really not big, it's just actually two rooms and one bathroom together with CR. Right here if you will make sure you can see the kitchen together with the dining, little dining room. The kitchen contains of like a couple of cabinets, there is also washing machine, the sink, a little electric stove with oven. We are really not into baking now, so I guess we will not use the oven. Here is a little dining area which we are using for eating, working, any kind of job. At the back you can see the fridge and right next to the fridge there is a couple of space we use for drying the clothes on the hanger. There is also vacuum and like a dustbin. Also if you will take a look out of the window you can see we have pretty good view because we live right on the edge of the huge city so it's quite quiet even we live right near the main road also we have a couple of plants decided to grow rosemary we planted actually maybe for about 30 40 seeds of rosemary but because of low germination of the <laughs> rosemary we only have one little baby and one mother so that's all for the kitchen and we can transfer it to the our bedroom which is full of empty space as you can see we still don't have much furniture we are still moving and waiting for the deliveries but for now we have here just the mattress just on the floor but it's still fine we found there is like a storage room for our unit. We found there is a wall mirror, so it was quite good. We just brought it out. Here is hanger of clothes, couple of dumbbells, and as I was saying, the views are pretty amazing. Yeah, as I said, so many parking spots, which is not really common. I was afraid before we was coming here, there we will have troubles with parking, but never happened. 
We really like this place. Right next to the entrance to our flat, we just have a huge cabinet for clothes and towels and all of the stuff like that. The stuff we don't want to have like on eye, we just put it inside. Like a little holder for shoes. And here, behind this little door, is our bathroom together with CR. It's very tiny, but actually it's more than enough for two people. The bathroom, shower, sink, mirror, and behind this wall is like the little CR. So that's how it looks like living in the room for and in the Czech Republic. Just for you to know, the prices for rent are about 500 bucks a month. Also, it depends how much electricity you use, how much cold and warm water you know. But still, for now, it's very affordable, very good place, and everything is fine. So yes, thank you guys for watching and um, don't forget to subscribe and like our video for today and stay tuned for the next video. Bye!